Okay, it's beer o'clock again, the Real Ale Guy. Today's beer is a beer from the Robinsons Brewery, and it's a ball of the Cheshire Black. This one's 4.1% ABV. It's described as a black roasted stout, or a rich roasted stout, should I say. Um, that's trying to read backwards. It's in a pint bottle, I've already opened it. Here is the glass of beer. I wanted to see your reactions to if you like a speeded up a review. So I just whacked it in the glass nice and quick. It is black. Not much carbonation rising. Actually there's really nice small bubbles. Carbonation rising. Let me see if I can get you to see them. There yes, there you go. Nice small carbonation. It was a one finger kind of off white creamy head. Let's get a nose. This one's it is it smells rich. It smells deep and fruity, like a yeasty fruity. It smells actually a little hoppy too. Nice kind of vinous roasted malt coming through there as well. And let's give it a taste. Cheers. Very smooth, medium to thin on the mouthfeel, a little bit of carbonation there, flavours. A little bit of vinous, fruity, then you get the roastedness on the end, so it's chocolate, coffee, caramel. But the vinous flavour in there is very prominent. Very prominent flavour in this beer. Quite nice. Quite nice. Quite a nice beer. Okay, this ebony coloured stout was first inspired by an original recipe dating back to 1892 and brought back to life by popular demand. It was originally used for the hourly paid beer allowance, most of which had usually been consumed before midday. Can't fault it. On many occasions this singing coming from the brewery could be heard for miles around. Enjoy the spirit of innovation that comes with Robinson's craft beers. As I say, 4.1%. The website for Robinson's is www.frederick-robinson.com. Check them out. I have just done a beer review in... It's going to be just over three minutes. What do I give this beer? Quite a nice session style. If I could improve on it at all, I'd probably go for something, ask them to kind of improve the mouthfeel a little bit. But that's the only bad thing I can say about this beer. I like the vinous notes, I like the coffee, I like the chocolate, I like the roasted flavours. So I'm gonna give it, I'm gonna give this beer an 8 out of 10. 8 out of 10 beer from the real L guys. Under four minute beer review. I thought I'd give it a go. Let's get a beer review done in under four minutes. Let's see what kind of gauge, what kind of reaction I get from it. So please let me know what you think of this under four minute beer review. Um, I better hurry up because it's going to go over four minutes if I don't hurry. Thanks for watching me. Put your comments in the comments box. Subscribe if you like and cheers.